right now we have the ISUPK in with us. And they are going to take us straight through to half past the hour, five o'clock. How are you guys doing today? Welcome. Shalom, the callers. I'm Shalom Aisha. Wells. Shalom, everybody. Don't know Shalom Aisha. What's up then? Right. Today we're going to um, talk about the mark of the beast. What is the mark of the beast? A lot of people saying the mark of the beast is um, Sunday worship. Mm. Um, um, the the microchip. Mm-hmm. Um, what I'm going to say it is the, the job. Mm-hmm. Right. But people don't know where's the mark of the beast. And today we're going to explain to people what is the mark of the beast. Right. Uh, another thing I must say, we the only people on the planet Earth that has the authority to teach this Bible. That's Nobody right. else has the authority to teach it. That's right. Anybody else will confuse you. That's right. And that is why the earth is, has so much confusion. Because people who are not supposed to teach the Bible is teaching it. We alone in the ISGBK have the authority to teach the Bible. So give me the first That's scripture. right. That's the book of John, chapter 8 and verse 32. And ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. Right. Once you know the truth, the truth will set you free. Right. We alone is the only people where you can get the truth from. Right. You cannot get the truth from nobody else. Everybody else who teach in the Bible is lies they hear. Right. And they're going to confuse you. So when you finally hear the truth from the prophets, you're going to be like a fish out of water. You won't know what to, what to believe mm. or who to believe. Mm-hmm. Okay, so much confusion, right? So go ahead, Genesis. The book of Genesis chapter 3 and verse 1. Now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field. Which the most which the Lord God made. Right. So now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field, right? Mm-hmm. Now the Bible was written by black people. Right. Black people have soul. Right. White people who taught us the Bible, they don't have no soul in them. Mm-hmm. They don't have no vibe right. in them. The Bible was written in metaphors. Right. Just like how black people are talking metaphors. Right. So the Lord called the other races beast. Mm-hmm. And he called us blacks and hispanic people his sheep right now in this context you know this beast this particular beast this particular race right remember all the races and them is beasts but right. this particular race of a beast he's so subtle he's like a serpent a serpent is a snake christians actually say that's a literal snake but snakes can't talk right right um if i am let me say aisha was going to, to rob a bank Mm-hmm. And I shall snitch on me. I go call she a rat. Right. She's not a literal rat. Mm-hmm. But I just saw black people just talk. Right. I was just using that to describe her characteristics. Mm-hmm. Um, the police and them in the States, people just call them pigs. Mm-hmm. Because of how they is. They're, they're nasty. They're dirty. Mm-hmm. Right? They just call them pigs. But there's not literal pigs. Right. It's just a way that black people used to describe them. Mm-hmm. Right? And this serpent was not a literal serpent. Mm-hmm. Right, it was it was a human being, but we're going to get into that. Right, this serpent was the so-called white man. Right, right, he's the only, he's the most subtle person on the face of the earth. Mm-hmm. You understand? Like like the, the Arabs and them had a show a video of cutting off somebody's neck to mm-hmm. take over a country and make put fear in you. Mm-hmm. The white man just had to come to suit and tie, and his country belongs to him in a week time. Mm-hmm. You understand? Your country belongs to him in a week time. Right, right. So um, is he? Next scripture here. Uh, Ezekiel chapter 34 and verse 8. Mm-hmm. As I live, said the Lord God, surely because my flock became a prey, and my flock became meat to every beast of the field. Right, so his flock became meat to every beast of the field. Right, the time when I say meat? Yes, sir. Go ahead. Because there was no shepherd, neither did my shepherds search for my flock. But the shepherds fed themselves and fed not my flock. Right? So now, without a shepherd to guide the sheep, the beasts will destroy them. Mm-hmm. So we black, Hispanic, and native Indian people, we is the Lord's sheep. Mm-hmm. And the other races is the beasts. Right. That is what you just read there. Now give me the next one. In verse 31. And ye, my flock, the flock of my pasture, are men so the lord said the flock of his pastor is men mm-hmm. so he was so the, the word sheep was just used to describe the israelites who is men right now he said the flock of his pastor of men mm-hmm. right and today the only good shepherd that have to um really lead the sheep and them in the right direction mm-hmm. or give guidance to the sheep the sheep is black hispanic and native indian people mm-hmm. is commanding generally hand. that's right you don't have no other good leader 
right. on the face of it. Right. You know, and, and if we had a good leader, mm. that would have never happened in Bitam where what happened today. That's right. Because somebody has to take responsibility for that, whoever is the leader for that. Right. You know, so, um, somebody commented and told me they went um, in the hospital to get swab. Mm -hmm. Right? Because I was getting symptoms. And mm. <laughs> what I say, in the hospital, didn't have water at that time, so they couldn't get swab. They had to wait mm. for them to um, for water to either come back in the hospital or for a water truck to come and get them water. Mm. What kind of good um, leader is that? Right. Whoever is in charge of that, a good leader will always make sure it has something there. So next thing the person's symptoms were so severe now, mm. they would have, have fallen and dead. Mm. They had to wait for water to come back. Mm. You understand? Right. Now this will happen here in um, the Bitum. Mm -hmm. The train and them getting sick. Mm -hmm. the, that that won't happen in um Westmoreland. Thank you. Where they have brown water and, and dirty water. The right. Carib, Carib, you need water to make beers. That mm -hmm. won't happen in Carib. Right. Um, Harry's water park is mm -hmm. clean water. You just jump in and bathe in, mm -hmm. not brown, dirty, um, nasty water. Mm -hmm. But again, it go happen in John John. It go happen in Silot. It go happen mm -hmm. in Bitum. Mm -hmm. You know, Labre. Mm -hmm. It go happen in the ghetto. Mm -hmm. Right, and a leader needs to take responsibility for that, whoever is that leader. Right. But in here, in the ISGBK, we have a good leader. That's right. So those things won't happen. That's Commanding right. General Yehana, he, he teaches us spiritually mm -hmm. and he, he feeds us mm -hmm. um, with, with clothes, food, shelter, mm -hmm. wherever it is we need. Mm -hmm. He's a good shepherd. Right. And that is what the flocks and them need today, the sheep. That is what black people need to be a good shepherd. That's right. Not shepherds who care about themselves mm -hmm. and starting to feed their own selves mm -hmm. and clothing their own selves. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yes, so sir. give me the, um, the next um, scripture. Come hey, Matthew. Yes, sir. Book of Matthew, chapter 10 and verse 5. These twelve Jesus sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go not into the way of the Gentiles, and into any city of the Samaritans enter ye not, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Right, so Christ and all said, call us sheep. Go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Mm -hmm. Again, the Bible is written by black men. Mm -hmm. We just talk in metaphors. Mm -hmm. We have soul. So they call us sheep. Mm -hmm. Christ and all call us sheep in the New Testament. Go rather to the lost sheep mm -hmm. of the house of Israel. Mm -hmm. Right, so give me um, Revelations. Yes, sir. 12 and um, Yes, Book of Revelations. Revelation, sorry. Chapter 12 and verse 9. And the great dragon was cast out. Mm, and the great dragon was cast out. Mm -hmm. Again, Christians go listen to this and say that this dragon is the dragon on Game of Thrones. Mm. That's what Christians go read this scripture and hear. This, this dragon is what you see on Game of Thrones. Mm. Right? But again, the John the Revelator, he was seeing a vision. Mm -hmm. Right, and what he was seeing, he was just describing the vision that he was seeing. Mm -hmm. So only a prophet of God could actually break down now what is this dragon. You ain't gonna find this in the Christian church. Right. But we're gonna tell a lot where the dragon is. Um, right. continue. Yes, sir. <coughs> that old serpent called the devil. And that old serpent which we just read in Genesis chapter one. Mm -hmm. That old serpent going straight back into Genesis, the serpent. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. And he is the devil. Right. Because Christ called white people the devil in the Bible. Right. Christ was telling the religious leaders, you are of your father, the devil. That's right. Because the black religious leaders mm -hmm. was following after white people. Mm -hmm. You understand? So Christ said, Allah learning from Allah Father, mm -hmm. who is the devil. Mm -hmm. Allah not supposed to learn from white people. Mm -hmm. You understand? And that's why other people could call in and say, um, the Bible is some makeup storybook. Mm -hmm. It's because they're learning from white people. That's it. They're not learning from true prophets of God. Mm -hmm. Right? So go ahead. I mean, I'll tell you exactly what you're saying there. That is why the, the scripture is now saying that the shepherds feeding themselves. Mm -hmm. You know? And then the, everybody was devouring. All the beasts of the nation was devouring the sheep. Just as you see in Bitam, just as you see in John, John, as you're now talking about it, that is exactly what you're talking about. But again, as you're just now saying, that the Lord will only deal with his prophets, and only a prophet of the Lord can break this down and show you exactly what it is happening. Mm -hmm. Only a prophet of God. Co mm -hmm. Continue, Tamo. Yes, sir. Um, and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. Right, and apart from calling um, the white man the devil, mm -hmm. he, we does call him Satan too. Mm -hmm. Because that is his characteristics. Mm -hmm. He is Satan too. Mm -hmm. And he deceiveth um, the whole world. Right. Um, is that more than that? Yes, sir. 
he was cast into the earth mm -hmm. and his angels was cast out with him he was cast into the earth and his mm -hmm. angels was cast with him mm -hmm. again this is a vision that mm -hmm. john the revelator is seen mm -hmm. when he was in prison he was seen a vision right. and anything that he could find whether it's a piece of paper whether it was the wall in prison you should just write it down mm -hmm. this vision mm -hmm. now the dragon is not the dragon where you see on game of thrones mm -hmm. a dragon does fly in the sky mm -hmm. and breed fire through its mouth mm -hmm. what does fly in the sky today and breed fire through its mouth mm. it's a vision john was seeing mm. he was seeing the white man's military that's right when that atom bomb dropping hiroshima and nagasaki mm -hmm. that was a dragon right that jet or plane that fly in the sky and drop that bomb. Mm -hmm. That bomb is fire. Right. That is what John was seeing. Mm -hmm. He was seeing the white man's military. Mm -hmm. Right? And when it says his angels was cast out with him, mm -hmm. he was talking about um, T.D. Jakes, mm -hmm. Creflo Dollar, mm -hmm. Pastor Coffee, Ashbishop mm -hmm. Charles Gordon. Right. You understand? Them is his angels mm -hmm. because them just do what the white man say to do. Right. They learn after the white man. Mm -hmm. They following after the white man. Right right so all those black religious leaders mm -hmm. all those religious leaders mm -hmm. they following after the white man That's right? right so now we're going into now the mark of the beast um yeah give me the one in revelation 13 and, two. 13 and 12 yeah it's a revelation chapter 13 and verse 12 and he exercised it all the power of the first beast before him right so he exercised it all the power of the first beast before him mm. now in order to know the bible too you have to know history right Right, um, th there's a strong brother in this school called Captain Katazar. Mm -hmm. Right, he's our brother. He, he knows a lot of history. Mm -hmm. If all of you all know history now, all of you know history. All right. You understand? You all get in contact with Captain Katazar, and he will teach all the history. Mm -hmm. You understand? So now, he exercised all the power of the first beast. Mm -hmm. The first beast is Rome. Right. So therefore, if it have a first beast, mm -hmm. it will have a second beast. Mm -hmm. The second beast is America. Right. Right, so the first beast is Rome, mm -hmm. the second beast is America. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. And causes the earth and them which dwell therein to worship the first beast whose deadly wound was healed. Right, so now, now America, which is the second beast, follows after the power of the first beast, mm -hmm. the first beast, mm -hmm. which is Rome. Right. Right, and the power of Rome is white supremacy. That's right. That is the power of Rome. Mm -hmm. And Caesar Borgia is the image mm -hmm. of the beast. Right. I remember as I explained before, the beast is all the other races mm -hmm. except black, black and Hispanic people. Right. Black and Hispanic is the sheep. Mm -hmm. All the other races is beast. Right. The image of the beast is Caesar Borgia. Mm -hmm. Right? When it says um, his deadly wound was healed, it was talking about there was a time in Rome when there's a time when Rome had fell. Mm -hmm. Rome had fall mm -hmm. and all the power that they had right and during the renaissance or the rebirth right america resurrected mm -hmm. the image of the beast which is seizure mm -hmm. and the power that came with rome mm -hmm. which is white supremacy right. right and of course all that we know who seizure borgia is he's a flaming homosexual mm -hmm. and his lover was leonardo da vinci mm -hmm. right he even had sex with his since his sister who is lucretia borgia mm -hmm right and he, he he killed his own brother for mm -hmm. trying to stop him mm -hmm. you understand mm -hmm. so that's who seizure Borgia is right so the the first beast is rome mm -hmm. the second beast is america go ahead um no All i right. want it here yeah. verse 13 and he doeth great wonders so that he maketh fire come down from heaven on the earth in the sight of men right he mm -hmm. doing great wonders right so um that i just what i said before with the atom bomb mm -hmm. right when the white man he dropped that atomic bomb on hiroshima and nawasaki mm -hmm. the world was marveled by it right the world was marveled that was the dragon that john was talking about mm -hmm. as not the not again not the dragon on game of throne but the white man's military right you understand the, the white man's military is so powerful Mm -hmm. You know, so, uh, well, America know that their military is so powerful. They just bully other nations right. with their military. Mm -hmm. they, like, like America don't even have to send troops anymore. Mm -hmm. They just fly a drone mm -hmm. and that is it. Right. They don't need to send um, troops. They just fly a drone. Mm -hmm. That is how powerful America's military is. They just bully other countries. Mm -hmm. God, other countries fear them because of their military. And right. John the Revelator, he was describing uh, the white man's military when he saw that 
that plane mm -hmm. jet and dropping that bomb that is the dragon mm -hmm. the white man's military right, right? so um yeah go ahead verse um, 15 mm -hmm. yes, sir. all right revelation chapter 13 verse 15 and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast right and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast so after the image fell in the days of rome America gave back life unto the image of the beast, right? And that image, of course, is Caesar Borgia, who the earth wrongfully calls Jesus Christ. Right. right? That is not Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. The earth has just called him Jesus Christ. That, that, that is Caesar Borgia, who is a flaming homosexual. Mm -hmm. right, go ahead. That the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Right? So that the image of the beast will speak in peace mm -hmm. and say god loves everybody mm. you yeah, know we should all join hands mm. we, we, where's all the, this violence for let me all join hands and sing kumbaya together now mm. that is what the image is saying mm. but meanwhile while that image is saying that mm. he's robbing raping and lynching black people mm -hmm. that's what that image is doing while he's speaking peace mm -hmm. all right so yeah good verse 16 and he calls it all both small and great rich and poor free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads mm -hmm, go ahead verse 17 that no man do you know um, what was that 15 you 16 16 yeah we, we, no 15, we 15. 15 and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast mm -hmm. that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many that w as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed right and if you don't worship the beast you will be killed right that is why in the middle east um they always at war with white people. Why? Mm -hmm. Because they don't want white people to put their democracy there. Mm -hmm. They don't want white people to put their philosophy there. Right. And they don't want white people to put their Christianity in that country. Right. That is why in the Middle East, they always have that war. Mm -hmm. You understand? The, the, we all can see what democracy is. Mm -hmm. Every day we vote in, every year, every what, five years in mm -hmm. general? Every five years we vote in. Mm -hmm. But black people still suffering. Right. You understand? So mm. democracy is not for black people. Why are we right. voting for? Mm. And black people still suffering. Mm. Christianity have absolutely nothing to do with black people. Right. Christianity does teach the women mm. who go into church mm. to divorce their husbands. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. That what Christianity does. And create whores in the church. Right. That what Christianity does. Mm -hmm. You understand? I'm believing in the white man's philosophy. The white right. man say, I'm, we as Africans. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, his his DNA says that um, we come from some part in, in Africa. Mm -hmm. You be want to believe that. Mm -hmm. Everything that the white man say, you have to do a research. Mm -hmm. If the white man say, I am black, I have to do a research to see if I am really black. Right. Don't just take it with a spoonful and, and run with it. Mm -hmm. So you can't believe nothing that the white man says. That's you right. understand? That's that white are all our in the Middle East there. Because them Arabs and them do what the white man to bring his philosophy and doctrines there. Right. And meanwhile, now the ones now mm -hmm. worshiping the image of the beast, mm -hmm. being molested, we being raped, and we being oppressed. Right. You understand? The, uh, again, as I always say, that sister in Mount St. Ben, and they could make that video mm -hmm. say that um, the pastor molested she in church. Up mm -hmm. to now, nobody mm -hmm. in, in come out and, and, you know, show some kind of support. No, no police mm -hmm. in investigate. Mm -hmm. Everybody just say, well, now nah, it's a pastor. Like, hush him out now. Nah. Then nothing if the pastor someone let's say just hush him out now. Mm. I feel hurt for that sister because she a black sister too. Mm -hmm. Make a video saying she get raped by the pastor and nobody do not mouth it. Mm. Nobody don't care. Mm. Now nah, man, you, you want to say something? Yeah, to yeah, for sure. And that's what has come along with Christianity. Right? The pastor getting off, off scotch. Him and, the, and all the politicians and then you continue to hear about what? Um human trafficking. Right? If you if you if you don't have a ring, they say that is no marriage. Right, so as long as the state can get some money off of your, you understand, the, the, the union that the Lord say, as soon as they lie down with a woman, or a man, you understand, a woman lay down with a man, your, that is yours for life. They say that that is not, you know, that not sanctioned, they say that's not right. Unless we can get some money from it, or have control over that man's life, to say if that, if that income about how we say, you follow, nothing can happen. They can have no benefits, they have no insurance, nobody can benefit here, no way, no way, shape or form. This, that is the society, and that is what the Middle East will be fighting against them all the time and battle like that. They don't want that shippingness in their country. Mm -hmm, yeah, that's right. You give me one 16? Yes, sir. Revelation chapter 13 and verse 16. And he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor. Right, so they're talking about all nations. They were talking about, he calls it all, both small nations, great nations, mm -hmm. rich nations, poor nations. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Free and bond. 
to, re to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Free and bond is talking about the third world countries. Right. Because even though those countries have freedom, mm -hmm. they're, they're, they're tied up. Mm -hmm. right? They're tied up in the, um, IMF. the IMF, the International mm -hmm. Monetary Fund. Right. Right, and, and so, so they come like if they're in chains or they're in bondage, right? Because the IMF does put sanctions on them, mm -hmm. right? So, um, so it was 17, no, it has we were 16 again, right? And he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, right? A mark in their right hand, mm -hmm. right? A mark, no, your right hand is your strong hand in the Bible, mm -hmm. so when it says your right hand is the hand you just fight with. Mm -hmm. So once they put that mark in the right hand, it's talking about fighting for the white man's military. Mm -hmm. You're willing to die for the white man's military just to protect the white man. Mm -hmm. You know, understand? You're willing to fight for the white man. Mm -hmm. That's that why he's talking about fighting the white man's military. Mm -hmm. You know, you're, you're going in the, any other race, you're fighting in their military. Mm -hmm. You understand? That's what he's talking about. Your right hand. In your forehead now, your forehead is talking about your mind. Mm -hmm. Your right. forehead was talking about believing in the white man's Christianity, mm -hmm. his science, you know, believing in the white man's democracy. Mm -hmm. He was talking about his mind. Right. You understand? Know Christianity have none to do with us. Mm -hmm. Pastors has been raping and molesting people in church. So why all you as mothers and fathers still mm -hmm. sending all your children to church? Mm -hmm. All you willing to take that risk mm -hmm. that I'm, all your son and daughter get I'm molested in church? Mm -hmm. You understand? Know why? It, it, it doesn't make sense. Right. We, the, the, well, the one in Mount St. Benedict make a, um, hmm. a video yeah. saying she get raped and nobody yeah. take it on. Mm -hmm. You understand? That is just show how evil and satanic the Christian church is. Right. It have absolutely nothing to do with black people. Right. Stay away from the Christian church. That's right. Because you're most likely that your son or daughter mm -hmm. will get raped or molested in the Christian church. Right. You understand? That, that is the mark in your forehead. Mm -hmm. Even though you know your son or daughter might get raped in the church. You still, because you had the mark mm -hmm. of the beast in your forehead, you still will send your church, your son and your daughter to church. Mm -hmm. You yourself might still go to church, even though the pastor mm -hmm. telling you to divorce your husband. Mm -hmm. You will still go to church. That is having the mark of the beast in your forehead. Mm -hmm. Having it in your mind. I was talking about your mind. Right. You know what I'm saying? Um, For sure. Verse 17? Yeah, go ahead. Revelation 13 and verse 17. And that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name right the name of the beast or the number of his name so mm -hmm. this buy or sell is not talking about going in the grocery store right right a lot of people feel the buying and selling is talking about going in the grocery mm -hmm. it is not talking about going in the grocery you have to think big that's right you understand know when they think big you mm -hmm. get to understand now it's talking about commerce right trading commerce buying and selling mm -hmm. commerce mm -hmm. Right? When America wants to stop um, a country from selling their goods, mm -hmm. what America does do? Mm -hmm. They just put an embargo That's right. on that country mm -hmm. to make them stop buying and selling. Mm -hmm. That way it's talking about something big, not going in the grocery store. Right. That has nothing to do with the market, the beast. Mm -hmm. You understand? Know a, um, a, what is it? A microchip. Right. And nothing to do with the market, the beast. That's right. You understand? Know if a microchip was the market, the beast, we have bought not all microchips already in China. Right. You know, Sam, because your cell phone have a microchip in it. That's Everything. Right. Your, your bank card have a microchip in it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm You have bought not your, your bank card, mm -hmm. bought not your cell phone. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm But the, the a chip mm -hmm. is not the mark of the beast. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Um, the, the, the taking the job is not the mark right. of the beast. Correct. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. you, you, you Christians and them just don't know the Bible. Right. Yeah, is that, um, verse 18? Yes, verse 18. Yeah, that's that's right. uh, Revelation chapter 13, verse 18. Here is wisdom. Um, just on reverse 17, the top. Yes, sir. And that no man might buy or sell. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. So, so the buying and selling again is not talking about goshi, it's mm -hmm. talking about commerce. Right. Right. Somebody putting an embargo on you. Mm -hmm. Right. Black and Hispanic people, we have no nation of our own. Mm -hmm. Right. Because everything was already taken away from that's us. Right. You understand? So we as black people, we cannot buy or sell anything. Right. You understand? We have to go to work for the other races. Mm -hmm. Right? After we don't work for them, we just get a paycheck mm -hmm. from the same other race that we're working for. Mm -hmm. Take the money that we get from them and go and buy food from the same races and them. Mm -hmm. 
then come back to work for the, those races. Yep. That is what we do. Mm -hmm. But we don't have no nation of our own. We That's cannot right. buy or sell. Mm -hmm. This is what he was talking about, not going in the grocery. That's right. You understand? There is no international steel company of the Negro. Right. There is no international um, toothpick factory mm -hmm. of the Negro. Right. Because everything was already taken away from us. That's it. You understand? We, we, we don't have it because it doesn't exist. Mm -hmm. You understand? Because we're not doing no commerce, we're not doing no trade, we're not doing no mm -hmm. commerce. Mm -hmm. Black and Hispanic people, everything was done taken away from us. Right. The white man done cut us off from everything. Mm -hmm. Alright, so black people as a race, we can't do commerce. Mm -hmm. This is what the man Kadibis was talking about, not going in the grocery. Right. I say, um, oh, verse 18, here is wisdom. Um, just want to give me easy time, nine, nine and four, yeah, four. Book of Ezekiel chapter 9 and verse 4. And the Lord said unto him, Go to the midst of the city, to the midst of Jerusalem, and set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sigh and that cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. Right? So that that is a mark of the Lord now. So right. apart from there being a mark of the beast, there's a mark of the Lord. Right. How you know there is a mark of the Lord? Come in here, you go see the mark of the Lord. Right. Everybody here else, else here, we following the laws of the Bible. Mm -hmm. Once they could see a man following the laws of the Bible, he have the mark of the Lord in him. That's right. If you see everybody else following Christianity, mm -hmm. everybody else following democracy, mm -hmm. you know they have the mark of the beast That's right. in them. That's right. Everybody believing in the white man's science and philosophy. Mm -hmm. Without going doing the research to find out if this is true or this is not true. Mm -hmm. They have the mark of the beast right. in them. Right. You understand? You, you, you mothers and them still sending your children to church. Mm -hmm. Knowing that the pastor might rape or molest them. Mm -hmm. You all have the mark of the beast in all you. That's right. You understand? The, the, the mark of the Lord is... Once you come in your ICPK, you will see it. Mm -hmm. you no, know, we have brotherhood and sisterhood in this school. Mm -hmm. You no know, one said, come and see that, that brotherhood and sisterhood. April 15th is the Passover. Come and experience true brotherhood right. and true sisterhood. Mm -hmm. You, you, and see those damn. Um, this is the first time you can meet people mm -hmm. when they come to the Passover, the ISUBK Passover. Mm -hmm. You understand? Well, it really is the last Passover, okay? It has no other Passover. That's right. Mm -hmm. You understand? You come in the ISUBK and you really see people for the first time. Mm -hmm. They go act like if them, them know you for like 50, mm -hmm. 60 years. Mm -hmm. First, that that brotherhood and sisterhood so real mm -hmm. and powerful. Mm -hmm. You understand? But give me the last one in the uh, The book of Revelation, chapter 13 and verse 18. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is six hundred, three score and six. Right? So six, six, six. Mm -hmm. Right? Um, what people are saying are six and six is? People are saying are six and six is. Um, the, the, uh, um, the, yeah, mm -hmm. the, the microchip that I mm -hmm. say, um, that says the job. I see mm -hmm. a man do a whole mathematical, some mathematical mm -hmm. equation to show how 666 is the, the, um, the job, the mm -hmm. COVID 19 job. I was like, God damn. Yeah, for real. Nah, man, these, these people and them, they, they're crazy. Mm -hmm. But again, they're learning from the church. That's it. And the church don't know what is the mark of the beast. Correct. All those people who in um, GOCC, GMS, mm -hmm. IUIC, mm -hmm. they don't know where is the mark of the beast. That's right. You understand? Know, so they're confusing mm -hmm. people. Mm -hmm. That 666 is just the number of people, mm -hmm. right? To be specific, the number of white people that control the planet Earth. That's it. That you can't see. Mm -hmm. When I say you can't see them, I, I mean literally can't see them. But I mean, you might pass the same white man that control the Earth every day and don't even know mm -hmm. he's one of the people in the 666 that control in the planet earth mm -hmm. and so when they read the book of job job the mm -hmm. book of job said the earth shall be given into the hands of the wicked that's right who controls the planet earth mm -hmm. no chinese in control the planet earth. no 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 arab in control right. the planet earth mm -hmm. you know so no east indian in control the planet earth mm -hmm. it's white people that's right white people own they control the planet earth mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know right. son? so that 666 was just the number of white people that controls the planet Earth mm -hmm. tells you what to do and what not to do, mm -hmm. and, and say what to teach in the schools and what mm -hmm. not to teach in the schools. Right. You understand? Um, to tell her when to, to send up um, mm -hmm. the, the oil the oil prices and when to drop the oil price. Right. 
Right. You understand? Know, that is just the number of white people that controls the planet. Correct. Right? All these other things, the people don't know the Bible. They're just confusing you. Mm -hmm. Again, you had to get into school and learn the truth about the Bible in the ISGPK. That's right. Because we have a good leader, and that leader is commanding generally a hand. That's right. Right? So I'm um, giving the Thessalonians. Um, 521. Second Thessalonians 2 and oh, right, right, 2. Right. Yeah. Understood. Understand? Hmm? Right. Second. What's, what's right? What's the second? No, nah, it's the last one. Yeah. Go ahead. At one. Yeah. Right. Because second, second Thessalonians chapter two and verse one. Ah, uh, verse, verse, yeah, verse two. Right? Yeah, go on. Verse two. All right. Verse, uh, verse two. That ye be not soon shaken in mind, or be troubled, neither by spirit nor by word nor by letter as from us, that as the day of Christ is at hand. Verse three. Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come, except there come a fallen away first. Right, so, this scripture here is actually telling you when Jesus Christ would return. Mm -hmm. Right, the, the Bible did say when Jesus Christ would return, mm -hmm. and he said it has to be a falling away first. Mm -hmm. Right, that falling away is talking about falling away from the lies mm -hmm. of the white man, falling away from... The white man's democracy falling away from the white man's christianity right once all us fall away from that christ is going to return right that is what the scripture is saying here mm -hmm. once that that sister again that sister will make that video in mountain but once people see that what our sister said that the pastor molesting the church mm -hmm. and we stop going to church mm -hmm. that is signs when christ is going to come back that's it again on you but if he's still going to church christ is in, in mm -hmm. one return yet it right. has to have a phone and we first. We just have about two minutes or so. All right. Mm -hmm. So, um, mm -hmm. so I'm here. Anything to say? Yeah, All right. So, um, with that, uh, don't forget to tune in to um, Black Watch tonight at nine. nine. Eastern tonight, Eastern tonight at nine Eastern time. Eastern time. Commander General Hannah, he's the leader of the nation. Right. Once mm -hmm. all I listen to him, everything going to run smoothly for Black and Hispanic That's people. It. Right. They follow any help, any counseling. Um, anybody who feel that um, they know the Bible and want to debate us, just call, take up the number, dial 290-5173. Right. That is the number to call again, 290-5173. If all of feel all of know the Bible, we will tell all of you, all of you know the Bible. Right. Because all of you know the prophets. That's right. All right. So, yeah. Um, yeah. All right. All right. Thank you so much, guys. We pause for a short pause. And we're going to